Welcome back to Red Glasses Talks. The title today is, you may not like it. That's not the title. The title is Chronic Complainers. It's very interesting in 1 Corinthians chapter number 10, and you can really start reading around verse 6 and 7, but the key verse is verse 10, and it says, and do not grumble or complain. Do not grumble or complain. And I'll let you read the rest of the verse. But in the context, starting at around verse 7, it's talking about adultery, idol worship, testing God, and grumbling or complaining. It throws it in with all those ugly things. And so, my goodness, so we need to be checking this out and checking ourselves. Are we a chronic complainer? So here are some things I've heard people complain about, and I'm sure I'm guilty of all these. Things like this. It's too hot and humid outside. It's too cold inside. It rains every time I plan something fun to do. It's been so dry, lady. My husband isn't very passionate. My wife, well, she has no passion. Or my kids, they won't apply themselves. My parents are always interfering. My church, it just doesn't meet my needs. My favorite team, they are pitiful. So in Philippians, in the Bible, the book of Philippians, chapter number two, verses 14 and 15, this is what it says. Do everything without complaining or arguing so that you may become blameless and pure children of God without fault in a crooked and depraved generation in which we shine and should shine like stars in the universe. So there's supposed to be something different about us if we have a relationship with Jesus Christ. I love that line that we shine like stars in this dark world in which we live. And so there are several things that I'm going to uh, mention to you that are, are negatives in terms of being a chronic complainer. So here they are. Number one, if you are a chronic or I am a chronic complainer, it's offensive to God. Number one. Number two, it's a poor example to people that don't know Jesus. Number three, it's a negative factor to our personal health in terms of the area of our personality. And so again, and there are more we can list there. So here's my thought. Don't complain, but instead be thankful. And this might be our, all of our prayers we pray together. Dear Lord, help me to shine like a star. You think about that.